My name is Dr. Taryn Lupo and I love mushrooms and I'm going to tell you how mushrooms are going to help save the world. Now I'm not even being um, a little over dramatic about that. I really do believe that something major is going to happen with what I'm going to talk about here in a minute and we're going to get to that but first I want to just tell you a little bit about the channel. If you have never been here before, I do how-to videos, and I also do educational videos that help you lead a more positive life. So, I am obsessed with mushrooms, and if you just look around my channel, you'll find out that I've got a big playlist of how to grow all kinds of different kinds. I also, myself, eat mushrooms every single day. I just love them. Now, a lot of people already recognize how good they are for you medicinally. And I have a whole story about medicinal mushrooms, which you can go watch because it's too deep to get in here. But the short of it is you, mushrooms have been associated to help uh, lower the risk of stomach cancer, colorectal cancer, and breast cancer. They're also anti-aromatase. They're, they're aromatase inhibitors. So in other words, they keep you from making high levels of estrogen that cause all kinds of problems in your body. Those are just like the simple things they do. They do so much more. I mean, they they can kill like super bacteria and I don't know. You just go watch the video if you're really interested. But we're going to get into why I'm actually here today and how are mushrooms going to save the world. Well, believe it or not, there are mushrooms that have been discovered that can actually eat plastic. Now, they have been around for a few years. People... Actually, the, the mushrooms were discovered in the 1800, but they didn't really know they could eat polyurethane. And not only do they eat polyurethane, but they can convert it to organic matter. The mushroom is called Pestiloteopis microsporia. And recently, around, I think it was maybe about five years ago, they discovered that these mushrooms that are from the Amazon can actually eat plastic and not only eat plastic, they can eat it in an anaerobic area. So in other words, they were very interested in that fact that they could throw a bunch of mushrooms in a landfill, seal it up, and in you know, 10, 20 years after it gets into everything, it's broken down all the plastic in the landfill. Now, mushrooms are fascinating anyway, because I always consider them this weird link between life and death. They're kind of like in the ether in, in a way they they can take something dead and make life out of it which i don't think anything else really does like mushrooms are kind of magical in that way and the fact that we are swimming in plastic have you noticed lately the stories uh, especially about um the oceans where they're just like pulling up whales and the whales are dead with 40 pounds of plastic bags in their guts just like you know our our mankind makes me sick about how they uh, destroy the planet and maybe this will help change the tide if we can collect large amounts of this plastic and throw these mushrooms on them perhaps it can save us from ourselves and i mean that in all the sense because you know there's more and more people being born every day and that trash got to go somewhere so the fact that we could break down these materials that would normally take hundreds of years to break down in, in just a few months uh, would be amazing. And, you know, it's mushrooms, man. Mushrooms are awesome. So there are some side effects of these mushrooms, though. They do um, affect a few different plants negatively. They're going to have to solve that. I believe there's some sort of trees in Georgia that, that don't uh, get killed by these mushrooms. So I, um, I hope they can figure out a way around that, but I'm sure they will because the positive benefit of having these mushrooms clean up the trash on the planet will be amazing. And I'm really hoping that soon they start running large trials of this and it just shows, you know, you find this little forgotten about mushroom in, uh, in the middle of the Amazon rainforest that we're cutting down and this one little thing's probably going to be a massive massive player in our future so again just another reason to add why mushrooms are awesome and they're going to save us if you want to watch um, my mushroom playlist there's all kinds of stories about mushrooms all you have to do is click over here you'll see it popping up and also i'll put the medicinal 
uh, you, you'll find the medicinal one in there that I talked about in the beginning. So just check that out. As always, be nice to that cat and go make some mushrooms. Go grow some mushrooms.